Hey guys, it's Ray, and today, I don't really know what this is gonna be. I'm gonna like, paint and talk about stuff. Hopefully it'll be interesting. I've kind of been a, in a bit of an angry mood lately, so hopefully <laughs> talking about it while doing something that's relatively relaxing makes me feel a little bit better because honestly kind of pissed off right now so <sighs> okay I was feeling a little bit self-conscious about my bony spaghetti noodle arms so I have a sweater now anyways yeah I'm kind of in a shitty mood lately and right now because there's just generally been like a shitload of stuff going on that isn't overly happy. But I did start going to school again. The last video I made was before I started and it's been a little overwhelming, but I'd say overall it's not like the worst. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. But lately and right now I still feel like pretty shitty honestly specifically right now because I was told by someone that they wanted to FaceTime and I asked when and they didn't reply to me for a whole fucking hour but you know me being patient and tolerant I was like okay Fine, maybe you just don't have your notifications on, maybe you didn't get a notification, maybe you forgot about it. Sometimes I don't do those things, sometimes I don't get notifications for Instagram. That's totally fine, understandable, reasonable. And then I checked it around an hour and they left me on red. I think I waited like another whole hour and then sent them a couple memes like did you forget to reply? Did you read this accidentally and just not reply to it? Like, what happened? <laughs> An hour after I sent those memes. No, it was two hours after I checked. And they've been left on red as well. And I haven't gotten a FaceTime call. And also, I haven't gotten a reply. So, you know. That's great. They specifically told me that they wanted to FaceTime me and I asked them when to make sure that I wouldn't be doing anything because I was already planning to film. So I wanted to make sure that I wouldn't be filming <laughs> when they wanted to call me, you know, so they wouldn't be interrupting my filming. And they just didn't reply, so, you know. Really fun, really, uh, really lovely. Uh, you know, just love getting left on red. I love being ignored. It's my favorite. It's, it feels really great for my self-esteem. I love it so much. I don't know. On the one hand, it seems like a little bit weird to get mad at that. But then also on the other hand, I feel like it's totally reasonable to be pissed off at that. Because, like, that's a really annoying, shitty thing to do. Just ask to FaceTime someone <laughs> and then when they ask you when you just fucking ignore them for like going on three hours now so you know love that I started school again and uh, I'm doing one class which I've mentioned before just doing auto and the first day that I was there, I was a little nervous to like actually be in class, but you know, uh, I went in with like my guidance counselor type thing and um, we kind of just stood in the back of the class for a bit and then I got, I decided I was a little too overwhelmed to like be in the class right away, like I might want to start again for like a new day and come at the beginning of class and then the next day I don't think I was at school um but the first class I did was pretty fun um 
it wasn't like the most fun I've ever had in a class, but like we were basically just taking apart desks and it was a little bit boring, but you know, that was, was pretty okay and not bad and I made my guidance counselor cry <laughs> when I stayed the whole class. Um, and then the next day I learned how to do an oil change, which was really fun. It was just a little bit like weird to, I guess, be in a class with people, especially since in my auto class, I am the only girl. There are no other girls. I, it is, it's just me. <laughs> I'm the only one. Like, I'm already a socially inept, awkward weirdo. How to make things even more awkward. <laughs> just be in a class full of boys. I mean, it's not the first time, because, like, in science, in grade 9, um, there were, there was, I was in a class that was majority boys with only one other girl, uh, so it was, like, two girls, including me, and then, like, a shitload of boys, which was, I don't know, for some reason it didn't feel that weird, but I feel like, I don't know. Anyways. I need to wash this brush. Actually, you know what, I'm too lazy, I'll just use a different brush. Oh, I also learned how to do a work order. That's pretty okay, but it's like paperwork. So, it's not the most interesting thing. You basically just write a bunch of shit down, like what you did, and then like, basically what it is. It's like a, it's like when you get a receipt at a restaurant, and, or like a, technically what it is, because it's like a receipt of like the things that you've done to like work on the car. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I totally lost my fucking train of thought and all I've been saying for the past like five minutes is um, yeah. I'm sorry. My brain is not working. Been in the shithole lately and I just, just, you know, you just can't get out. I'm stuck. <laughs> like the bottom of the hole. Kind of feel like I'm sinking honestly. <laughs> Which is really depressing but like, it looks like orange juice. Do you like to see my orange juice? I'm not gonna be able to pick that up. Okay, I'll just take it. See, it looks like, like orange juice. Like, you wouldn't want to drink that. But like, it looks really nice. I like the color of that. It's like watery orange juice. I mean, like peach juice. Peach juice is the best. Because peaches are really good. I just have to suffer and wash this brush. Go more in depth on the oil change because that was like one of the only really interesting things I've done so far. I attempted welding, but I couldn't see through the mask and it, I had no idea what the fuck I was doing. So, I mean, I had help, obviously. I'm not just gonna attempt that by myself. Uh, but yeah, I couldn't see through the mask, so I couldn't see what I was doing literally at all. So, makes it a little bit difficult <laughs> to like, be able to do it properly if you can't even fucking see what you're doing. I don't know why, because the other dude who was also learning didn't seem to have any trouble seeing through the mask. Or maybe he did, I don't know. Uh, I, I couldn't really see, <laughs> so. But, uh, the oil change was pretty cool. Because like, I got to work on it with like, a bunch of different people, so. Um, I'm not even painting anymore, I'm just talking. <laughs> nice. I don't know, it was a little weird, like, being around people in general, but also just, like, working with people. Because generally, I don't do, like, group work and stuff, because I don't have friends, and I'm socially inept. <laughs> I don't remember the names of any of the people that I was working with, because I don't remember things like that. I will remember your face, not your fucking name. <laughs> fucking good luck if you meet me. I'm sorry, I'm not gonna remember your name. Guaranteed, won't remember it. Tell me it like, and within five seconds, I'll forget it. Uh, yeah, so I don't really remember any of the names of anyone that I, I did the oil change with, but the one dude who I was introduced to first, the first question he asked me, and I shit you not, was, <laughs> do you smoke weed? Hell of an introduction. The first question you ask someone when you're being introduced to them. Because, you know, that's all that matters. Clearly, if you've seen that video that I made not too long ago, I'm not. Because <laughs> I can't. I'm sorry. 
if this is really boring. My brain isn't working. Just, like, watch me paint or something. That's interesting, right? I've been using the same brush this whole time. Which isn't even, like, a proper brush. It's a brush that was shitty, and I think it had, like, glue stuck to the ends of the bristles. So I cut it in half, and now it's, like, weird and stumpy and, like, perfect for this, so... I should probably talk about the oil change that I've been trying to talk about, but every time I start talking about it, it ends with, so yeah, it was really cool. <laughs> because I lose my train of thought, so I just end it. Basically, what I got to do for the oil change, I mostly watched, but like, what I did was I got to like, my brain is not working. <laughs> See, like, this is the thing, I don't even need to be on anything for this. My brain just doesn't work properly. <laughs> I also don't need it to escape because my brain just escapes itself. It's called dissociation. And I do that because of PTSD, not because I'm on anything. So, you know, fun stuff. Um, fucking hell, what was I talking about? Um, what I did basically was I got to fill up the engine with oil. I kind of did it like a little bit backwards. I watched the f end of one oil change and then started another oil change if that makes any sense so like I kind of learned it a little bit backwards <laughs> filled up the engine with oil and like you're taught how to change an oil filter and like how you know when the engine has enough oil in it because it has like this metal stick thingy with like a plastic thing on the end and like can tell because it's like oil on the end of it when it has enough in it yeah <laughs> and also the thing where you pull the plug out of the oil thingy and then there's just oil everywhere and it got all over my hand and it felt really gross and then <sighs> I washed my hands and it didn't come off so then, when I went back to guidance, I had to wash my hands again. <laughs> I tried my best, okay? <laughs> but it wouldn't come off. So, that was pretty cool. I also learned how to use a, a torque wrench to, like, tighten tires and stuff. That was, that was pretty sick. Is it still recording? Okay, I have, like, two minutes left to ramble about stuff. I have more stuff to ramble about, believe it or not. I've just been very struggling very struggling <laughs> of course i've just been struggling to form complete sentences to talk about my first topic so not even my first topic like half of the first topic i'm like struggling through it i just can't remember what to talk about and it's written down in front of me this looks really pretty they kind of look like uh the what are they called the things from the lorax why can't I remember what they're called? Truffula trees, that's what they're called. They're like fluffy, kind of what they look like. They look like the Lorax. They're yellow and orange. The next thing that I wanted to talk about to do with school was like grades and stuff. Cause I mentioned in that last video that um, I was a little bit overwhelmed by work, but um, apparently, fucking lucky me, Basically, what we decided to do was, like, see if I had enough of a, like, enough of a, I don't know, a high enough percentage that I could, like, just get a pass and then move to the work that wasn't done at all yet, which is nice, so I don't have to worry about that shit anymore. Because most of it's, like, mostly done. There's just stuff from, like, the second semester of grade 10, which, like, hasn't been done at all because I wasn't in school for that. Kind of in a shitty mood now. <laughs> like, I don't know. Uh, I don't know, I guess just being ignored feels fucking shitty. Just kind of in a mood. It's been weird, like, because the whole summer I had like a friend and then going back to not having any friends and not really being in a place where you can make friends. I don't know, it feels a little shitty when like the only friend you have is really far away. 
it also feels really shitty when the only friend that you have is kind of being an asshole. You know, fun stuff, as always. Having a great time over here. I thought I had a lot more to talk about. It seemed like a lot more than it was, and now that I think about it, it's not really that much. But, I mean, we could do like a quick little time lapse of me painting for a bit, I guess. I made myself so annoyed and angry to the point where I've literally given myself a fucking stomach ache. So, I think I'm just gonna paint for a little bit and like, you can watch, I guess. this was a little less interesting than things that I normally make. If they're even interesting, I don't know. <laughs> Sometimes, like a little bit. But yeah, I hope you like my tree. Um, and I hope this video was somewhat entertaining. I'm sorry if it wasn't. I'm honestly just in a shitty mood right now. Hopefully I can film something better soon that's less angsty but yeah you can like it if you liked it you can subscribe if you want like turn notifications on if you want to see these videos like weekly for some reason <laughs> don't know why you would um i also have an instagram i have two of them two of them <laughs> i listed three um i'll link them in the description if you're interested one of them is my main, and one of them is my spam, and you can follow them if you want. That's about it. Um, I'm gonna go now, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. <laughs> Bye.